I have a few new things that I've really been loving here lately. So today I'm gonna tell you all about them. So I haven't done one of these videos in a while where I talk to you just about stuff that I'm into. Fun fact, I used to do monthly favorites videos every single month, uh, but I stopped doing that a while ago because it just kind of seemed like a lot, like I don't have a ton of new stuff every single month to show you, but periodically I do like to do these videos where I just show you a few things that I've been into over the past few months because sometimes I find really good stuff and I want to tell you about it because I know I always like hearing about good finds and I think you might enjoy that as well, so that's what we're doing. Now, today's video, there's no food stuff, so heads up on that, but I mean the whole channel is about food stuff, so if you want to see food that I'm into, there's lots of videos for that, um, especially my grocery hauls. That's a really good place to see stuff that I'm buying at the grocery store. Um, so just so you know, if you want food stuff, that's where you can go for that. But we're going to talk about some other fun things today. And to start things off, let's talk about fitness. So there is a new to me class at my gym that has become like my new favorite thing, and it's called Mixed Fit. Now, I don't know how long Mixed Fit has been around. I think my gym might have actually had it a long time ago, and then they got rid of it, and now they recently brought it back. But whatever. It's new to me and I really, really am loving it. It's a dancey style group fitness class, um, kind of like Zumba, I guess, but more, more, um, more dancey than Zumba is. And that is right up my alley because many of you know that I did dance from age three all the way through until I was an adult, all different types of dance, ballet, tap, jazz, lyrical, point work, all kinds of things. Um, and so that is a place, some, well, first off, dance is just something that I really love, but it's also something that is super familiar to me and comfortable to me. Now, obviously mixed fit isn't like going to a dance class, but it is in that vein and I just think it it is so much fun and my mom is actually the one who told me about it she had taken it a couple times and well she, I think she'd been going for a little bit actually and she was like you know I think you'd really like this class it really seems like your thing you should totally come to it and she was 100% right and I just love it and it's been really fun to have a fitness thing that I'm excited about because there have been a couple classes at my gym that I really liked and they'd gotten rid of them and then I didn't really like the other stuff that was there and so it was hard to figure out things to do when you don't have something that you're really really excited to go do and make happen but now that I have this class I'm super pumped about it and I'm always really really excited to go to the class and I love it the whole time and I feel great afterwards it's just been a really really awesome thing moving on let's talk about clothing specifically bras and the bras I'm going to show you today are all from the brand lively so I was in need of some new bras the situation was that I had this one bra that's kind of like my standard go-to. It's got underwire in it. It's not It's not like the most uncomfortable thing ever, but it's not super comfortable. Um, and I was kind of sick of that, and I just didn't like being in something that felt uncomfortable. So I started wearing a few sports bras that I had, like regular bras. Uh, they worked under some of my clothes, especially in the winter. They worked pretty well because a lot of that clothing is thicker. But I needed something that would look good under thinner clothes for the warmer weather and also just because I needed something that was more of a real bra. I wanted something that was more of a real bra but also comfortable and trying to find something in the middle ground. So it's something I had been running through my head and then I saw an ad for Lively and it looked like they might kind of have what I wanted so I started digging in to them, ordered a few things, and there are several things from them that I got that I really, 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 really like. So uh, Lively has a lot of different styles and options, but the thing I feel like they're kind of known for are their bralettes. So I got a few of those, and the nice thing about their bralettes is they have ones for um, a wide range of cup sizes. So if you are on the larger size as far as your chest goes and you feel like you can't wear bralettes, they don't fit you right or whatever, they do have one called the busty bralette and that is for people who need something that's bigger. So something to look into if that's you. For me, I'm right at the edge of the kind of standard whatever, the, the smaller one. I'm right at the upper edge of that so I ended up getting that one but the other option is there too um, if that's something that you're interested in. So. I'll show you the ones that I got. I got this one in navy and it has this like striped band. Their designs are just really really cute. They are um, they kind of have like a feminine touch but they're not super super girly and they're you know minimalist. They're not loud crazy prints or whatever um, but they look nice and this is super super soft very comfortable and like I said just kind of that nice middle ground of being more like a real bra 
but still comfortable to wear. So I got this one, and then um, I also got this bralette. This is similar style, but the detailing's a little different. So it's got this mesh thing going on on the edges, um, and like down here on the band. I think it looks super cool, and it's one of those, it's like a bra that it's okay if you see it. It doesn't look like it should be hidden. It looks like it should be seen. It kind of has a split strap. So if the straps are poking out, or if you have like a shirt that kind of scoops down on the side and you see this, it doesn't look like a mistake. It looks intentional. It looks cute. I really like it. And again, super, super comfortable. Um, I also got a more like sports bra style from them. This is not something that I would wear under like regular clothes but more for like around the house and being comfortable and stuff um it's not gonna look that cute just like this because it's it's not on me um but you can kind of see it's got a cross back thing going on and again it has like the really cute band and this one is also really really soft when i have this sports bra on just kind of like around the house hanging out a lot of times i forget that i'm wearing it which is a great thing to happen. Like that's that's what you want um, in something that you're launching around in that you it kind of feels like it's not even there. So that one's nice too. Um, and I'll have links for stuff below the video if you want to go check it out or whatever. Uh, but I really, really like all three of these. Um, and so I'm really happy that I bought them and I think I'm gonna be buying some more of these in the future. Now to kind of go along with the bralettes, one small problem with them is that they have no lining so you can get some nip showing through the shirt which is fine if that's what you're going for it's not what I'm going for so I wanted a solution for that because I got the bras they were great but there was just this one little issue and I wasn't sure what to do about it uh, but I did some looking around and I found something that has been perfect and I'm super excited about so these are called nippies they come in this like little nice package um, they're you know those uh, like things that you can get when you have like an open back dress or something they look like I don't know they like look like a skinless boneless chicken breast they're like those like silicone things that you stick to yourself and it's supposed to be like a bra but it has no straps uh yeah it's this kind of reminds me of that in that it's the same idea but they're just to cover your nipples so they come in a few different shades and they they come in the case they're on this plastic thing right now but uh you just peel them off and stick them and they stay in place and these don't have any adhesive so they do have ones that have adhesive but i got the ones that don't and they work great it's almost like magic like you just stick it on there and it stays put so i wear these uh when i wear the bralettes uh, so I get the coverage I need, but I can still wear the comfortable bra. I really, really like them. So if you are in need of something like this, um, whether it's because you have these types of bras, or maybe you have an outfit where you can't really wear a bra and you want something that's going to give you a little more coverage or security, I like these. And they're reusable. So, you know, you can get different types of covers, but they're disposable and it's kind of wasteful. And also, if you have a situation like with these bras where I need this, it's not like a one-time event thing, I'm going to need it all the time. I really didn't want to go that route. I wanted something that was, you know, going to last. So these, um, you know, you can use them over and over and over again and they'll keep working and you just rinse them off when they're done and then I just put them back in the case. And I really like this case because, you know, if I can open it, there we go. Um, it just keeps them nice and contained and clean and ready for when I need them. Another item I wanted to show you is a makeup item. I really enjoy makeup. I think it's really fun and I've been into it a lot more here lately. I'd kind of gone through a period where I just wasn't as into it. I wasn't paying attention to new stuff that was coming out, but now I'm much more in the know and just kind of paying attention and excited to try new things. Um, so this is one of those things and it is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Amrezy Highlighter. This is it's beautiful. Um, it is limited edition. I don't know how limited edition it's going to be. You know, that it's kind of like a thing to make you buy stuff, which totally works for me. Like if something's limited edition, I'm like, okay, I gotta have it. <laughs> um, but this highlighter is beautiful. So, you know, I'm not a makeup, this is not a makeup channel. So 
just work with me but it's this it's just this perfect like warm golden tone but it's not too like it's not too warm because I don't have a super warm skin tone I'm kind of neutral to cool toned um and it works for me well I'm wearing it today on my cheeks and on my nose and stuff I really really like it, it and from what I've seen when before I bought it when I was just looking at reviews of it on YouTube um it seems to look good on everyone like it just seems like that just the perfect color uh so if you look if your complexion is similar to mine then i think you'll like it but even if it's not definitely look into this and see if maybe you can find someone who looks similar to you wearing it because i've seen a lot of people say that they really like it and let me know in the comments do you have any fun finds or things that you've really been into lately because i always love hearing about the stuff that you're liking and i'm sure everyone else would like to hear about it too and if you happen to be new here and you want more healthy eating tips and nutrition info and videos like this one then make sure that you subscribe because eating healthy and living a healthy lifestyle really doesn't have to be complicated and i want to show you how to do it and if you want to watch some more videos I have a couple linked over here that you might like thanks for watching I hope you're having a great day and I'll talk to you next time